G'day everyone. What on earth is going on here? This is more Peruvian mystery. This is unbelievable. There's been a cataclysm or some treasure hunter has blasted the top of this away thinking that this is some kind of building looking for treasure and I'm just wondering could there be any possibility at all that they were right that this is a building and I'm thinking there is a possibility that it's a building and we'll get to it we'll get to it look at this it's a fountain made from the same type of rock but it appears to be just a large sort of one piece of stone much the same rock as this the same color the same type we come to this this is very odd in another video I suggested it's all it's all poured because it's all it's often the same type of stone the same consistency that's just weird I, I don't want to get into that but this is what the video is about and this defies all theories all methods of trying to explain what this is no matter what theory you believe in this will defy it and this is a wall at Olante Tambo and this is truly strange I'll, I'll try and explain what's going on I've got two photos of this and yeah the, the second photo shows a lot more what's going on now if you believe that this is carved from it looks like a slab of rock you must then explain why there are brick shaped or block shaped objects here here we have a block shaped object seems to be something's been poured over the top here this line sort of continues and if you look at the top the top of this it's something's just poured down now either that is it's all basalt granite and that's the structure of the basalt granite it's, it's lava or something has actually been poured on top here you see this crack right there and the whole thing's been covered up somehow or it's been melted or something's happened as for what this is we don't know if if this was built if these are bricks that nubs are found on 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 the large blocks you see and here we have evidence of this now these could be two blocks it's usually two nubs per block so here we have one block two nubs one block two nubs it's as if it's been built they're all on the same level as if it's a structure but there is a theory that these point to solstices or something this is some kind of temple it's a bit bizarre here down here we have a structure which reminds us of those weird weird stone structures which defy all explanation which are found in Peru and other perhaps other parts of South America and I'm going to stop stop calling this all proto-Inca or pre-Inca, I'm going to call it Chavin. Chavin is the oldest culture, born in 1200 BC, but the fact is uh, this stuff could be way older than that because the same builders were at Giza 2600 BC or earlier. This defies all explanation. If this was built, what's all this other stuff? If it wasn't built, why are there nubs? Supposedly these are for lifting. I think they're actually for, for joining it onto something else. It could have been all poured. What is it? Like this, it is nothing. It is nothing. It is, it is something that's been destroyed. I think these fit into the nubs. This is from Machu Picchu this wall is quite poor quality but they have they fitted these stones in for some reason they must have got these from somewhere picked them up and shoved them in this is the other picture I have of this wall from Alanto Tambo and this kind of explains a lot of what is going on 
in terms of this being a destroyed structure. I think it was actually all built. I'm gonna sound like that guy wise up, but I'm starting to think it was all built. And this would explain what has happened here. Look here, this is an extra detail which people who take photos of this do not show. This is another recess, but it appears to be a door. This door has been sealed. What is going on? Look, it, it would have continued, but more recent peoples, the Incas perhaps, have built something here. And they might have destroyed this structure in order to build these, these rocks, in order to make these rocks. This continued, right? It's almost too hard to believe that molten basalt has been poured over the top lava, essentially, and has solidified of bricks. Large boulders, I mean. Cut stone. Or poured stone. And this could be the same mixture which has been poured over. I don't know what this is. Has it been carved? If it has been carved, one would have to explain the tools they used. And they didn't have the tools to carve it. Everyone says, oh, it's carved, it's carved. They didn't have the tools. And if they did have the tools, then they also had the technology to pour it. And this is just bizarre, this is just... More nubs up here, if, if I really zoom in, look at that. This whole thing it looks like a giant crystal. It's as if there's vertical stairs here. Nubs, this is a Lantai Tambo. But they're on top of the stone, it's as if it's to join it up to something. The whole thing looks as if it's somehow... It's either carved out of rock, which would take an awfully long time, or the whole thing is a, a destroyed stone fortress. Even up here you have, it looks like a, a, a circular, it, I'm not sure, that could be a circular tower or an astronomical tower. You see, look, cut its, its discrete areas. Look at that. It, it's as if it's been Blocks have been placed here, this has been cut out of the mountain, blocks have been placed here, or the whole thing is built. It doesn't look like it's been built, because look at this, this is, this is geology here, that's happening here. So I don't know what this is. That's really weird. And again, it's really weird, what, this looks like just a house really. This is Machu Picchu. The Incas came here to essentially a ruined city and they rebuilt it to hide from the Spanish. And when they rebuilt it, they, they placed all these stones on top. All their, all their predecessors put their stones on top. And the previous civilizations, perhaps the Chavins, built this. And this is unbelievable. Why would, you, why would anyone order a stone cut like that? Why would you do it? It doesn't really seem to make any sense. It's a base stone, it absorbs stress on each side. Thanks.